Hey, hello, Unheard Voices magazine and radio. I'm Nairobi Nelson, a comedian, a entrepreneur. Um, I produce a show called Comedy for the Soul. We uh, go once a month. Um, I also host any venue that you have, uh, from Sweet Sixteens to weddings to fundraisers. And you know, and everything we do, everything that I do, I enjoy, and we laugh. And I, well, my main goal is to touch your soul with laughter. Well, I was born in Oceanport at the uh, military hospital, which is no longer in existence. Um, I'm from Neptune, born and bred all my life, and that's it. I ain't going nowhere. Technically, on stage, on, on, on my last run recently, uh, it's been almost three years, but I've always been a comedian right here. When I first realized I got the comedian bug, it was in first grade. In first grade, we were watching a film called Beltman, and it was about a, a guy running around with putting belts on people, seat belts, mm -hmm. and for their own safety. And during the movie, I don't know what got into me, but I, I got five people's attention, and I said, Psst, this is my first joke. I said, look, belt man without a belt. And I dropped my pants, and everybody was cracking up. And that's when I found, that's when I realized today is when I got the comedian bug to perform in front of people and make people laugh. Red Fox, you know, sneak watching Red Fox, but my favorite comedian that really inspired me, that who I thought I was, it's Eddie Murphy. I love Eddie Murphy. He can do no wrong in my eyes. And he's straight. Uh, this is definitely it. But if this wasn't it, before this, I, I coached uh, Pop Warner football for nine years. Mm -hmm. And that was my thing. I love to coach football. I love it. But almost as much as I love comedy. Comedy, I touch people's souls. People come in from a hard day's work, a hard week's work, uh, life's, when life smacks you in the face, turn around and make it funny. And then we all laugh. And then we touch your soul at the same time and you feel better. Okay. And that's what I like to do, make you feel better. Go for it. Put your feet on the ground. Don't listen to anything negative. Comedy, stand up comedy is hard. And no, not everybody can do it. So when you put your, put it out there that you want to do it, everybody's gonna be like, "Oh, you're not that funny. You, you're funny, but you're not that funny." Go for it and try it, and then we'll see. Time will tell who's the funniest. Oh, and you don't have a Valentine. What about this? What about the Gibson table? You don't got a Valentine? Hmm? No. no? <laughs> fellas, let the dogs loose, fellas. Oh, wow. Yeah, we got one. We got one on it. We got one on y'all better stop acting. Y'all better stop acting like puppies. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? The girls, the girls ain't shy. Look, girls, let me get a cat call. <laughs> Ladies, let me hear a cat call. Come on, don't. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies, let me hear a cat call like you mean it, like you're trying to get a dog to bark. Said mom is dialing. <laughs> Marcus, I don't have my panties on. <laughs> <laughs>